I'm back. Hi, my beautiful babes. I'm finally back. So <laughs> let's talk a little bit. So I ended up breaking my camera for the second time. And <laughs> your girl broke her phone, as you can see. Who is she? So got a new phone yesterday. I got the, uh, the what? the iPhone Pro Max so the video quality on here is really good the camera is dope as hell um so I figured I would do an updates video for you guys just because I've been just because I've been itching to film literally like I was like how much is a camera um a new camera lens for a Canon D <laughs> okay clearly I haven't talked to you guys in a while so clearly I'm a mess and also with this corona bullshit going on like I feel like I'm delirious from staying inside um all all my life <laughs> I'm sure most of you guys are going crazy too so I just thought I'd use my phone to film um right now I look a little crazy I just got out the shower I'm doing a face mask I was filming before I hopped on here with you guys, um, me and my friends are doing the no rush challenge and I was like, this is kind of cute. So I got a face mask on, I'm looking like a little scrub and then you just go like this <laughs> and then you're cute, you know, like the little TikTok hack. So if you guys want to follow me on TikTok, it's at Let's try this again. If y'all want to follow me on TikTok, my name is Bridget Michelle 96 Um, I don't post a lot. I'm trying to like learn the dances, but um <laughs> it's kind of hard when your girl's almost 17 weeks pregnant. We're gonna talk about that in this video. But first, let me get this mask off. Figured I'd try some new products with you guys. I'm gonna do my makeup just like a little bit because I don't feel like doing full glam honestly but it'll be nice to do get a little cute um i think me and my boyfriend are going to target in a little bit um just to pick up some fresh produce and a couple other things we ran out on um he might need some vitamins just like little little shit you know hold on let me <coughs> and we back so i just did my little skincare routine um, I've been switching up a couple of things. I just got like an eye cream um, and a new moisturizer because literally this winter has been hell for my skin. Um, I don't know if it's changes like with my body with the baby coming or what, but I had to switch some stuff up, sis, okay? So let me move my janky phone, my old janky phone. Let's Let's not come for the new one. And let's get started, shall we? So, I got this new little makeup case at Target about a week or two ago. I went with my friend Cheyenne and her son, Makai. I love Makai. It says, drink some coffee, put on some lipstick, and handle it. Because, period. I honestly haven't been wearing that much makeup lately just because we're literally all stuck in the house. Um, who am I trying to get cute for? TikTok. <laughs> um, y'all, I try to do the dances and I'm just not very good. So if y'all can dance, please hit me up because we could collab on little Sun Sun. My friends can dance. Um, so it's like, <laughs> okay, so what am I good at? Just kidding. There must be a couple of things I'm good at. Okay, so we're going to use this Mercury Retrograde Huda Beauty. Um, I got this in the mail probably in like October, November. I actually filmed a first impressions with it and <laughs> I don't know. I just didn't post it because my boyfriend was like in the background playing the game and it was just loud and um, I was just updating you guys about what happened like with my miscarriage and all of that. Um, if you guys weren't aware, I did have a miscarriage before um, we got pregnant with our baby right now so I'm very blessed we're very blessed um I honestly can't even believe I'm pregnant I when I did my ultrasound my first one well 
like I don't know probably like a month or two ago it literally like was like that's inside of me <laughs> like I I was like truly so so happy because I never even was my first pregnancy I didn't even get to see the baby um all I saw was I didn't even hear the heartbeat um but yes we're not going to talk about that today <laughs> just because I'm so tired of talking about it and um I just want to talk about positive things <laughs> this is like a positive happy video despite all the shit that's going on right now literally I feel like everyone's just like I don't know down in the dumps like depressed as hell I know I have been um so I'm gonna do my makeup today try to feel like a little cute a little better about myself and hopefully you guys watching this um can get a couple laughs out of it I know I'm a funny bitch well, let's be real <laughs> so first thing okay well Here's the thing. I was wondering if we, I should do my makeup the regular way, how I usually do it, or if we should follow the viral TikTok video where it's like you spray your face first with setting spray, or you do foundation first. Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna look it up. Okay, so I was wrong. It's moisturize, then like a powder. Like translucent powder. I don't have a translucent powder, so I just use my um, Neutrogena Mineral Shears powder foundation thing. Use it all the time. And then setting spray, and then a primer, and then a foundation. Don't have a primer either, so I'm, I just use my foundation. But literally, I've tried this, and like your face really does look effing good. So we're just gonna go with that today. Um, my moisturizer is dried down a little bit. I do my toner the um what is this Thayer's and then I do my moisturizer and then I do my um eye cream so let me know if you guys have done this before sorry I'm just trying to make sure I'm still recording I'm still trying to get used to um this phone I just got it yesterday but um it's way bigger than my XR and <laughs> I wasn't recording one of the clips, so I want to make sure we don't have to do my makeup twice today, okay? Okay. So let me know if you guys have tried this because I think it makes your skin look hella bomb. Um, I know TikTok's kind of like super hype right now. Like everybody's downloaded it. Everyone's like, oh, I'm not going to download that, me included. And then... <laughs> You just give in. We're fucking bored, right? So, for those of you that don't follow me on Instagram or literally any social media, we are expecting. Um, how did I get pregnant? I'm sure you know. <laughs> um, we were trying this time. Honestly, like... We were trying the first time too, like not not as much as this time. I just I know my body, like I know my cycle, whatever. Not to be TMI and weird, but my boyfriend and me have been to, well, my boyfriend and I have been together for four years. It'll be five in November, but like um, twenty six, and I don't know. He knows my body too, you know. Um, setting spray. This is the NYX. Bear with me. Prime Set Refresh. I like this a lot. It's very refreshing. But I feel like you need a lot of this. Like, I'm sure you don't. <laughs> but I want my face to feel, like, super hydrated when I have on um, my setting spray. <coughs> Sorry. I have this too. This is like my go-to, but I don't know. The other one's more like a lighter setting spray and the black um, NYX setting spray is just like super, super like, girl, your makeup will not come off. You're gonna cry tonight. You're gonna dance. You're gonna get two slaps. It's not gonna come off. I got you. I mean, hey, can't be mad. So got pregnant um we were trying this time the first time we weren't really trying as much like 
obviously we've been together three years. Yeah, I had my miscarriage last summer. So we've been together like three and a half years. Um, if it happened, it happened. Obviously we were gonna be happy, but um, this time we were really, really trying. <sighs> I'm like so out of breath. I get so out of breath so easily, you guys. So if I'm breathing heavy, it's cause your girl is a little thick right now. Baby's growing. <laughs> I have my water right here though. Literally drink like three of these 32 ounce bottles a day. Like I just keep filling this up. I drink so much water. Okay, so I'm gonna let this dry down a little bit and then we do the primer, don't have it. And then we do the foundation. So I'm just gonna go ahead with the foundation. I stutter a lot too. I have pregnancy brain, so I literally like forget everything. Or I can't remember anything or <laughs> my words get all jumbled together. Also, this is the, where is it? Um, one second. <laughs> so this is the foundation I've been using. It looks really ratchet right now. It's just a Fenty Beauty. That's my go-to. Um, I broke this though. I accidentally like pushed it. <laughs> off my table so the little pump doesn't work as well um i should honestly just probably get a new one uh everything's just been closed though i guess i could order some but i kind of want to try something different if you guys have any recommendations on like drugstore or you know high-end um foundation let your girl know because i've been looking to try something new um, I kind of want to go back to MAC and get something, because MAC's my go-to, too. I haven't been there in forever, though. They closed the one in Uptown. So, new Beauty Bender. I'm obsessed. I got it at Target. Somebody recommended this to me. Um, she's thick. Way thicker than my one I just threw out. That one was looking real ratchet. So, how many weeks am I? I'm currently 16 weeks, 6 days. Um, this Saturday, I'm going to be 17 weeks. I have my 16-week appointment tomorrow at my doctor, which is good because I thought that um, everything was, like, all my appointments were going to have to be canceled or something. Because um, now I go in every month or so, and then when the baby gets closer to coming... Um, you go in like every week and then every couple days and it just gets closer and closer as you get closer to your due date which I really love because um, they're making sure everything's okay and you know with this pandemic going on I'm really effing scared um, some people that I follow on clearly I'm stressed out I just took the longest breath <laughs> um, some people some girls that I went to school with they've had their babies already and Ryan's sister had her baby um, during this time like um, April 1st and I think like at the beginning of May Mar no my birthday March 13th is when his sister had her baby daughter um, Bring it down to the neck because we don't want to be looking crazy out here, okay? Um, but they had their babies just fine. They had their babies just fine. Like, I don't know. I'm just nervous. It's my first kid. Everyone's like nervous, you know? I just want everything to be okay for baby and I and I don't want there to be like obviously if things don't go the way i i had planned them that's fine but i don't want any like or like crazy ordeals to happen like oh we can't have the baby in the hospital so you're gonna have to do it at home like a home birth like i'm that person that thinks of crazy scenarios in their head and like the worst possible outcome unfortunately like with my baby with my first newborn baby yes i'm gonna be fr a little freaked out i can usually like come to terms and try to be like a little bit like okay bridget calm down you're chirping but this like i 
I have no idea what's gonna happen. So, um, if anyone has any ideas or, you know, not ideas, sorry, I can't talk clearly. If anybody has any advice on how to like calm down or like exercises you can do during like this crazy pandemic, corona, COVID-19 shit going on, like please let me know because I've been having hella anxiety lately. I've just been trying to like mellow out and um, I've been doing yoga a little bit, not a lot, let's, <laughs> let's not get crazy, but I've been doing yoga a little bit, just like stretching and getting my breathing under control because when I have anxiety, it gets really hard for me to breathe. I get hot, my palms get clammy, or I'll get really cold. It's just, it's really bad. And I know it puts, if the stress is on me, it puts hella stress on the baby. And I don't want to do that to my baby. So, I will take all the advice y'all have. Do we like this? Can you, like, tell a difference? Because I definitely can. It just goes on so smoothly. Um, I don't know if you're supposed to go ahead and go on with concealer, but I'm going to do a little bit just because, mm, should I? What y'all think? <laughs> I'm not going to today just because I'm boring and um, dark circles are in right now. So why would we cover them up, right? So this is what I usually use, just the Fenty Beauty. This works really good if you do have dark circles, like myself. Um, so I'm going to apply a little more powder. And then we're going to go in with eyeshadow. So how have I been doing during all of this? Um, I've been freaking out. Honestly, like some days are better than others, but if I don't have like anything to like distract myself I literally go crazy and <laughs> it just makes me feel insane because I'm out of work right now and I miss my daycare kids so much I need to go back to work I'm gonna go in with the NYX matte bronzer um but I've been wanting to create for you guys so much like if I had my camera I would have made like a video like at least a couple videos already and uploaded them just because I miss getting to connect with all of you um especially right now it's just important for everyone to stay in contact like keep your distance but check on like your introverted friends check on you know, family members, older, like grandparents, um, older teachers that you've stayed in contact with, you know, like just check on everyone because right now everyone needs each other, especially with this no contact order thing out. Everyone's like super depressed and I mean, some people love it. I am going insane. <laughs> a little bit oh i'm so pale we're gonna do brows this is just the <laughs> this is just the precisely my brow pencil by benefit i love it and i have the same brow gel for it so you guys may be asking what are we having um i don't know yet we both don't know um we were gonna do a gender reveal and then this whole <laughs> thing happened so I just went ahead and ordered the balloon anyway my best friend Nina in Miami I just got back from seeing her in March went down there for a week just for like a little birthday getaway for myself and like an early birthday treat and I haven't been using the pencil I just use the spoolie I don't know why I just haven't really liked Ooh, my face is just I haven't really liked to I don't know fill my eyebrows in but this is gold so we don't know what we're having it but I did go ahead and just order the balloon just because like I thought it'd be kind of cute for me and him to figure it out and like be hella surprised um I have a feeling it's gonna be a boy Ryan thinks we're gonna have a girl um 
all of my friends and his friends think it's a girl. <laughs> so we shall see. I'm going to try to get him to wear pink and I'll wear blue. I wanted to wear like a really cute blue dress. Um, but I just, I don't know. I was going to order something off Fashion Nova and I just didn't. So we'll see. Oh, wow. It's really hard to talk into your eyebrows. I see why so many, oh, I almost dropped it. See why so many beauty gurus do their brows off camera because, um, hello concentration. Okay, so brows are done. Um, I kind of messed up. I'm just going to wait for it to dry and then I'll clean it up a little bit. Yeah, like right there, whatever. That's because I was trying to talk to y'all. Okay, so yeah. Um, whenever this damn balloon comes in from Amazon, I'll go ahead and post it on my Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, it's at Miss Bridget Michelle. If you guys do want to follow me and see bump dates and find out the gender of my baby and stay updated with me, I do follow back. We're just going to go ahead in with this palette. Um, I've been loving the color Cosmic mixed with Galaxy mixed with Off Balance. So this, 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 I've just been like mixing the three. I'm like kind of obsessed. Honestly, I'm not the best at eyeshadow. I just kind of like mess around with it. Um, this isn't going to be like beauty guru worthy. James Charles, come for me, please. Please come get this and beat my face. I would love you to. Or Jeffrey or Shane, literally anyone. So yes, um, Nina is supposed to just tell, we haven't figured out who she'd tell yet, um, what the gender is of my baby, but somehow someone's gonna have to fill the balloon for us with the confetti, either blue or pink, and then we'll just go ahead and pop it, and then we'll be surprised, and then we'll share it with you guys. Um, and the balloon is supposed to come at the end of this month, April, so says by the 26th, we'll see. I hope it might come a little earlier. One of my packages from Amazon came, so I'm kind of hoping the other stuff comes. I ordered like a yoga ball, a yoga mat, uh, the balloon, some other stuff. I've been like going crazy. Well, this is actually from Pretty Little Thing. <laughs> um, I just got this little, I don't know, crop top. It, it's fine. I could have got a medium, but then like, the Chi Chi's have gotten a little bigger, which I've never had in my life, but this baby is like making everything huge. So not really mad at it, but kind of mad at it because I like don't know what to do with them. Um, I've never had big boobs in my life. I've always had big legs and a big booty. And then I just got these little sweatpants from them. Um, they're comfy. They're not very good quality. I was just watching um, Molly and Bailey let me start my eyeshadow. I'm just chit chatting. I was watching Molly Ann Bailey. Um, she ordered some stuff from them. And I ordered the same sweatshirt she did. Um, it said like worldwide or something, which reminded me of Pitbull. <laughs> um, it's just like a pink and gray hoodie. It's super cute. And it fits nice. But she was saying Misguided has better like quality things and like no shade, no tea. <laughs> um, pretty Little Thing has just like Fashion Nova quality stuff. So I kind of agree. But these sweats are kind of comfy and I kind of fuck with this shirt. So it's okay. No shade, Pretty Little Thing. American Idol Who? See, like... I don't know. I do eyeshadow, okay? Don't come for me. Okay, so I finished my eyeshadow. I think it's kind of cute, kind of cute. I'm going to brush away the excess under my eyes. And I think it looks kind of good. Um, I don't do lashes. I know lashes would complete this look. I suck at them. I just, I'm not good at them, you guys. Um, so don't come for me again. <laughs> so, a little bit of highlight. This is my tried and true Amrezy palette. I love this. 
and I feel like I got this last year I had a vlog about it um and maybe even a year and a half ago but I mean it hasn't hit pan yet I give you like a lot of products which is very appreciated so um I should have done like a Q&A but I didn't I just wanted to like touch base with you guys and say how much I missed you and love you and i'm praying for everyone going through this because it's not easy i will be moving into a one bedroom downstairs of my apartment um at the beginning of may so i'm gonna be moving out of the studio and into a one bedroom just because i feel like i'd go crazy <laughs> Um, trying to raise a baby in a studio I just don't feel like it'd be enough room um, and if I needed to get away for a minute I don't have a really a room I can go to to just take a couple breaths and get it together um, because like I said you guys this is my first baby I don't like have any idea what I'm doing yes I have experience with children working at a child care center but I don't I've never had a baby. I don't have kids, so, um, but Ryan's really good with kids. He has a bunch of nephews and little brothers, so we will be okay. I know how to change diaper, like, the simple stuff, you know? Um, a lot of, it just comes with, like, motherly instinct, so I'm excited. I'm really, really excited. I've wanted a baby, like, since I was little, and obviously like this world is crazy right now and I'd be selfish um bringing a baby in this world if I didn't think I could care for them and if I wasn't going to put my baby like ahead of myself not be selfish you know everything I do and everything I work towards is going to be for my baby so just had to get that out there because I'm so excited and I could get emotional, but I'm not. <laughs> I'm so, 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 so scared to give birth. Um, my friends, a lot of my friends all have kids. Some have more than one. So they've given me like birthing advice. They're like, girl, <laughs> get that epidural. Some say don't. I'm just like, I'm gonna get the epidural. Because <laughs> I don't think I could do natural birth. I mean, obviously as women, we're you know, we were born to have children. I mean, if you don't, that's fine. I'm not saying anything, but our bodies were born to like have children. So I feel like, I don't know, we can withstand anything. We're, we're literally bosses. We're like amazing, amazing human beings. We can go through anything like periods. Oh my God. Oh, I just sprayed my face again with some setting spray. Does it look good? Do we love um I just love like soft glam like this I don't need to like go all out like I said I don't do like lashes but if I did do lashes I'd look so fine watch yourself so I got this NYX um lip pencil and I got this Miami with Nina we were like bored so we went and got some makeup um what was I gonna do? I forget. <laughs> love it. Love pregnancy brain. Okay, so I just applied some NYX um, lingerie. This is in the color six with my lip liner. I don't know if I like the color, but we shall see. I'm obviously not wearing this <laughs> out in public um, without a bra, let's be real. Now I'm just going to go in with my telescopic mascara. It's my favorite one. It gets my lashes so long. Sorry, my man's playing the game, so it might be a little loud. I've had people tell me that I don't need lashes, and I mean... No one needs lashes, but like the thing is, they're fun to put on and you look like a bad bitch wearing them. So why not put them on? Because your girl literally has 
no patience <laughs> and I always mess it up and like I don't know my other friends are better at makeup than me and I'll just have them help me <laughs> I feel like I look so funny <laughs> doing my mascara. <laughs> I'm gonna watch this back and be like, girl. The game's getting intense. So this is the finished look, you guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm sorry if it was kind of quick. I'm just, I don't know. I just thought I'd film like a little updates video for you guys and like get cute and do my makeup a little bit. I just wanted to get like the up close for you guys. Um, I'll set it back down. <laughs> but yes, I'm gonna go clean all this mess up. Um, if you could see my bathroom counter, you'd be appalled. Um, I'm gonna go change into some real clothes and then we're gonna go to Target and I'm gonna get cute for Target. So that's what I did. I love Target. Literally, I can like spend hours in there and now with baby on the way, I'm like, okay, let's buy this and this and this and this and this. Oh, hold on. I gotta show you guys something. So I don't have much for baby yet, but I just bought some stuff that could be like gender neutral these oh my god i got these at target i'm like obsessed with little baby beauties <laughs> and then i got um this this is like six to nine months so but it says black history in the making and i just thought it would be kind of cute because ryan is mixed so our baby will be mixed um and yeah i was just really excited i like I'm really happy how like life took a turn for the best for me even though like it's not the best in the world right now you know what I mean like I'm not trying to sound selfish or anything I'm just really happy that everything is flipped from last year from when you know I was just blaming myself for the miscarriage and I was just really depressed and honestly it just wasn't the right time for us and now god or whoever is up there has given us another chance and i'm just super excited i'm not super spiritual or anything i just do believe like in karma and second chances and timing of everything and i just am really really blessed right now we're all very blessed right now um i hope everyone is staying positive and healthy and i will hopefully see you guys in the next video love you guys bye